right, welcome to this tutorial on how to save and load records from file. So, first off, um, I've just created a new console application in Delphi. Now we're going to have a, a, a type for the record, I'm just going to call it something like test record, which is, is equal to a record. And then I'm just going to start something like name, which is a string, and then date or something, which is going to be an integer. Because it's just only going to be two digits just to mess around. Then we're going to end the record, right? And then if we're going to save and load records from file, we need two types of variable. We need um, a save file, which you can name as anything you want, which is actually um, a file of test record. Test record like that. Uh, one thing I forgot to mention is a string. You have to set a limit on it if you're actually going to use save a, a record to file, okay? And then we have a with file, which again you can name what you want, which is just test record, right? And now to actually save. Well, first off, I'm going to read ln and go enter name or something like that. And then we're going to read ln and just going to have a, a read ln, the actual name variable there. Read ln name and then we're going to copy oops, copy and paste this. Actually that should be write ln, not read ln. Write ln, sorry. Write ln. Uh, enter date and read date, right? And now we need to actually assign the file something first. So assign file and it's going to be the actual test save file and then to a file name, so I don't know c test.dat anything you want. And then we're going to, now there's two commands that we can either use. You can either use rewrite or reset. Now what the differences are rewrite actually deletes any data that's previously in the file and just creates a new one on top of it. Reset will open the file at the last position, um, will open the file and allow you to write to it or read to it without deleting any of the previous data. But if you use reset when the file doesn't exist, you'll have a problem because you need to use rewrite then. So if you're creating your file for the first time, you use rewrite, or if you want to delete all the data, you need to use rewrite. So rewrite and then save file and now we want to open the file so we go with we use a loop here with the with file with file do and then we go while um, no that's for reading now we need to begin and an end right so now we can do that and then we want to use the command write okay Save file with file, okay, and um, just oops, did something wrong there. For some reason, I uh, I must have actually altered the name by accident. There we go. Okay, so now uh, we just got there we go. Okay, so you see that? So we've got a type which is a test record, and a um of name and data. So first of all we can enter the name. Just type in that, enter the date. 21st or something. And now we want to actually read the data. So I'm going to copy this. I'm just actually going to change this, sorry. I'm going to reset save file. And this time, instead of rewrite, we want to put in read. Okay. Read save file. And then, of course, we want to this time just output the data instead of inputting the data. Um, so, as you'll see, we'll have name, which is, and then we'll output name, and then we'll do the same with date. Okay? And then we'll read our pause the display 
and there you go it's outputting mat and 21 which is at what we actually saved to the file okay so that's how you can save individual records you could always oh it you could always save arrays which are inside the records as well so that's it for basics saving and loading from file with records